he's a dark type user. He's like, oh man, what's going on? Challengers one after another. It's because there's multiple people challenging the Elite Four today. It's foreshadowing that there's more than one person at play here. <laughs> oh, he does leave with Scrafty first. I couldn't remember. <laughs> okay, so, Scrafty is a Pokemon you've seen me use. It's uh, dark fighting, very slow, very bulky. Good move, set. Second is this Crocodile. Well, sadly, you know what? I want to keep Seismitoad in for him. Alright, Crocodile's the final form of, uh, of Crookerook and Sandile. Very high speed, very high attack. It uses a move called Foul Play to use my attack stat for damage, which is actually kind of silly because the Crocodile's attack is actually higher than mine. But not very bulky at all. And dead as a result. But up next is Bisharp. You should be familiar with this Pokemon, because I have one on my team right now. And that means that you're well aware that this Pokemon does not want to get hit by a fighting move. Like this. Oh, but it's quicker than me. Very high attack, very high defenses, decent speed, very low special defense. Does not want to get hit by fighting moves, and now it's dead. So all that's left is the part. Probably haven't seen this thing in a while, just because it's really not that powerful. It's gonna use, probably use Fake Out. Or Night Slash. Oh, it didn't even go for an attack. It didn't go for Fake Out. I thought it would. <laughs> oh, this may actually kill me. I better be careful here. Oh! Flint still have the lucky egg. I think he does. 